Imagine a land where the sands of time hold tales of civilizations long past, where the echoes of diverse cultures resonate. Welcome to Algeria, a country nestled at the crossroads of history and culture. Begin with the ancient era, where the first traces of humanity were found. The prehistoric paintings of Tassili Najer, dating back to 8,000 years ago, tell us stories of a time when the Sahara was lush and green. These ancient people, known as the Berbers, were the original inhabitants of Algeria. Step forward into the Phoenician era around the 9th century BC. The Phoenicians, a seafaring people from the eastern Mediterranean, established trading posts along the coast. One such post, Icosium, would later become the bustling city we know today as Algiers. The Roman era, starting in the 2nd century BC, brought significant changes to Algeria. The Romans built grand cities like Timgad and Jamila, complete with theaters, baths, and temples. Their influence is still visible in the remnants of these cities scattered throughout the country. Moving into the 7th century AD, the Arab conquest brought Islam to Algeria, significantly shaping its cultural and social fabric. The language, literature, and art all took on an Islamic flavor, blending with the indigenous Berber traditions to create a unique Algerian culture. The Ottoman era, starting in the 16th century, added yet another layer to Algeria's rich tapestry. Algiers became a powerful pirate stronghold, feared and revered by European powers. This era left a significant architectural legacy, notably in the form of the Kasbah, a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The French colonial period, from the 19th to the mid-20th century, was a time of tumultuous change. Algeria became a part of France, and French influence permeated every aspect of life. However, this era also saw the rise of the Algerian nationalist movement, leading to the War of Independence in the late 1950s. Finally, we arrive at modern Algeria, a country that gained its independence in 1962. Today, Algeria is a melting pot of cultures, shaped by its diverse historical influences. It's a country where you can explore ancient Roman ruins, stroll through Ottoman-era kasbahs, and experience the vibrant blend of Berber and Arabic cultures. In conclusion, Algeria stands as a testament to the resilience and adaptability of its people. From its earliest inhabitants to its modern citizens, Algeria's history and culture have been shaped by a multitude of influences. It is a country where history is woven into every corner, from the ancient rock paintings of Tassili Najer to the bustling streets of modern Algiers. So, as we journey through Algeria's sands of history and echoes of culture, we find not just a country, but a living, breathing narrative of humanity's shared past. A past that continues to shape the present and will undoubtedly influence the future. A past that invites us to explore, learn, and appreciate the richness of our collective heritage. This is Algeria, a country at the crossroads of history and culture. Have you ever pondered on the mysteries of history? Ever wondered about the ancient civilizations that once flourished in lands we now call our own? Today, we journey back through the sands of time, to a land steeped in culture and history, Algeria. Our journey begins in the Neolithic era, where cave paintings in Tassili Najer bear witness to the early human presence in Algeria. These paintings, dating back to 6,000 years before Christ, depict a thriving culture, immersed in hunting, farming, and perhaps even early forms of spirituality. Fast forward a few millennia, we encounter the Phoenicians, seafaring traders who established trading posts along the Mediterranean. One such post, later known as Carthage, grew in influence and power, marking the beginning of the Carthaginian civilization around the 9th century before Christ. The Carthaginians left an indelible mark on Algeria, contributing to its rich tapestry of cultural heritage. As centuries rolled on, Algeria became a prized jewel in the Roman Empire. Roman Algeria was a time of prosperity and growth, Cities like Timgad and Jamila, known for their Roman ruins today, were bustling metropolises, reflecting the grandeur of Roman architecture and urban planning. But the narrative of Algerian history would be incomplete without acknowledging the enduring influence of the Berbers, the indigenous people of Algeria. From their languages to their customs, the Berber culture forms an integral part of Algeria's historical heritage, a testament to their resilience and adaptation in the face of foreign invasions. Our journey then takes us to the Islamic Golden Age, a period of intellectual and cultural growth. Algeria was no stranger to this efflorescence. The Great Mosque of Algiers, Kasbah of Algiers, 
These architectural marvels are but a few examples of Algeria's contribution to Islamic art and architecture. This golden age was not just about architecture. It was a time of scientific, philosophical, and literary advancements. Algeria was a part of this intellectual revolution, contributing to the fields of astronomy, medicine, philosophy, and literature. In the heart of all this history, a unique identity was forged, an Arab-Berber identity. The fusion of Arab and Berber cultures is a fascinating tale of synthesis, not conquest, shaping Algeria's unique identity. To summarize, Algeria is a land that has seen the rise and fall of great civilizations, from the early humans of the Neolithic era, to the Phoenicians, Romans, and the Arabs. Each of these cultures has left its mark on Algeria, contributing to its rich historical heritage. The enduring influence of the Berbers and the fusion of Arab and Berber cultures has shaped Algeria's unique identity. The contributions of Algeria to the Islamic Golden Age in science, philosophy, and literature are notable highlights in its historical journey. So, the next time you ponder the mysteries of history, remember Algeria, a land where ancient civilizations have left their indelible marks, shaping not just a country, but a unique cultural identity that continues to thrive today. In the heart of the Mediterranean nestled between Europe and Africa lies a land steeped in history and culture, Algeria, a nation that has seen the rise and fall of empires, the sting of colonization and the triumph of independence. It's a tale of resilience and endurance, a testament to the indomitable spirit of the Algerian people. Today, we journey through time to unravel the rich tapestry of Algeria's history, beginning with the Ottoman rule. The Ottoman Empire, a formidable force in the 16th century, extended its influence to Algeria around 1515. The Ottoman rule, while not directly administered, was characterized by a system of local governance. Beyliks, the provincial administrative units, were governed by beys, local rulers appointed by the Ottoman Sultan. They maintained a degree of autonomy, protecting and managing their regions while paying tribute to the Ottoman Empire. But as the sun began to set on the Ottoman Empire in the early 19th century, another power was rising in the West, France. The French conquest of Algeria began in 1830, marking the start of a new chapter in Algeria's history, French colonization. The French rule was a stark contrast to the previous Ottoman administration. It was direct, centralized, and aimed at assimilation. French was made the official language, European laws were imposed, and vast tracts of fertile land were seized by settlers. The indigenous population was marginalized, their rights stripped away, and their culture suppressed. However, the Algerian spirit was not so easily subdued. Resistance against the French rule simmered, fanned by the flames of nationalism and the desire for self-determination. This resistance culminated in the Algerian War of Independence, a brutal and bloody conflict that lasted from 1954 to 1962. The war was a fight for freedom, a struggle for identity, and a testament to the resilience of the Algerian people. The war ended with the Evian Accords in March 1962, and on July 5, 1962, Algeria finally claimed its independence. The proclamation of the Algerian Republic marked the end of a 132-year-long French rule and the beginning of a new era of nation-building. In the years following independence, Algeria adopted a non-aligned foreign policy, refusing to align itself with any major power bloc during the Cold War. It became a vocal advocate for the rights of developing nations, championing the cause of decolonization and the fight against imperialism. To recap, we have journeyed through the Ottoman rule, the French colonization, and the Algerian War of Independence. We have seen the resilience and endurance of the Algerian people, their struggle for freedom, and their journey towards nation-building. It's a story of a proud nation that has weathered the storm of history, standing tall and steadfast in the face of adversity. Algeria's history is a testament to the power of perseverance, the strength of spirit, and the enduring hope for a better tomorrow. Have you ever wondered how the world's largest hot desert coexists with diverse cultures and traditions? Welcome to the stunning Sahara Desert, a place where cultural diversity thrives against all odds. In the vast expanse of golden sand dunes and piercing blue skies, a symphony of cultures harmoniously blend. The Arabs, Berbers, and the Tuareg people, each with their unique traditions, coexist, creating a rich tapestry of cultural diversity. Imagine the rhythmic beats of traditional music echoing in the desert air, the hypnotic swirls of dancers in vibrant attire, 
and the festive spirit encapsulating the Sahara in a vibrant cultural cocoon. Among these cultural marvels, the Tassili Nadjar Festival stands out, a celebration that pays homage to the prehistoric rock art that adorns the Tassili Nadjar region. This festival is a testament to the Sahara's cultural heritage, a time when the desert pulses with life and color. Then, there are the Maulid celebrations, a commemoration of the birth of the Islamic prophet Muhammad. The Sahara transforms into a spiritual sanctuary, resonating with prayers and chants, a testament to the spiritual depth of its inhabitants. Yet, the Sahara is not just a cultural melting pot, it's also a testament to human resilience. Here, the nomadic Tuareg people have made the desert their home. Their lifestyle, steeped in tradition, reflects their adaptation to the harsh desert environment. They navigate the endless dunes guided by stars and ancient knowledge, their vibrant blue robes billowing in the desert wind. Their music, their language, crafts all tell a story of survival and adaptation. Despite the challenges, the Tuareg people have maintained their cultural traditions. They have preserved their unique language, Tamashek, their music and their craft traditions, passing them down through generations. They have adapted to the modern world while keeping their cultural roots intact. The Sahara's landscape too tells a story. The mesmerizing beauty of the Tassili Nadjar rock art, the majestic Hogar Mountains, all bear witness to the Sahara's rich cultural history. These landmarks stand as symbols of the Sahara's resilience, its ability to sustain life and culture in the harshest of environments. In summary, the Sahara Desert, with its golden dunes and azure skies, is more than just a geographical marvel. It is a testament to cultural diversity and human resilience. It is a place where Arab, Berber, and Tuareg cultures coexist and thrive. It is a place where traditional music and dance breathe life into the desert air, where festivals like the Tassili Najer and Malid paint the Sahara with vibrant cultural hues. And at the heart of this cultural tapestry, are the Tuareg people, their nomadic lifestyle a symbol of adaptation and survival. The Sahara Desert, therefore, is not just a desert. It is a living, breathing testament to the power of culture and the Imagine human spirit. Imagine the allure of the Mediterranean, with its azure waters, golden sands, and the tantalizing scent of the sea. Now, add to this scenery a backdrop of vibrant cities, each one steeped in history and culture, their architecture a captivating blend of the old and the new. This is Algeria's Mediterranean coast, a dazzling tapestry of natural beauty and human creativity. Among these coastal cities, Algiers and Oran stand out. Algiers, the capital, is often referred to as Algiers the White, due to its whitewashed buildings that shimmer under the Mediterranean sun. A walk through the city reveals a fascinating blend of French and Moorish influences, an architectural style that is both unique and enchanting. Oran, on the other hand, is known as the Radiant City. It's a bustling metropolis where modernity and tradition intersect. The city's Spanish roots are evident in its historic quarter, where grand colonial era buildings stand alongside traditional Moorish houses. The vibrant street life in these cities is a sight to behold. The markets, or souks as they're locally known, are veritable treasure troves. From artisanal crafts to aromatic spices, these markets offer a sensory overload that's quintessentially Algerian. And then there's the food. Algerian cuisine is a delectable fusion of Berber, Arab and French influences. From hearty tagines to the delicate flavors of couscous, the culinary traditions of these coastal cities are as diverse as they are delightful. Language plays a vital role in the cultural fabric of Algeria. Arabic, Berber and French are the official languages, each one adding a unique layer to the country's cultural identity. Regional dialects are cherished as they help preserve the rich tapestry of Algerian culture and history. In this journey, We've explored the Mediterranean charm of Algeria's coastal cities. We've walked through the streets of Algiers and Oran, marveling at the unique blend of French and Moorish architecture. We've experienced the vibrancy of street life and markets, and tasted the culinary delights that are deeply rooted in the country's diverse cultural influences. We've delved into the linguistic diversity of Algeria, understanding the significance of Arabic, Berber and French in shaping the country's cultural identity. Through it all, 
we've come to appreciate the unique allure of Algeria's Mediterranean coast, a place where history, culture and natural beauty converge to create an unforgettable experience. This is Algeria, a Mediterranean gem that continues to captivate and inspire. A place where every city tells a story, every meal is a celebration, and every word spoken is a testament to a rich and enduring cultural heritage. Have you ever pondered on the tantalizing flavors of Algerian cuisine or the rich biodiversity that this North African country boasts? Today, we embark on a journey through the sands of time to unravel the story of Algeria's culinary heritage and its vibrant natural landscapes. Algerian cuisine, a delightful fusion of flavors, is a testament to the country's vibrant history and the Mediterranean and Maghreb influences that have shaped it. From the Phoenicians to the Romans, the Arabs to the French, each civilization left a culinary imprint enriching the gastronomic scene with a fusion of tastes and techniques. The quintessential couscous, a staple in every Algerian household, mirrors the country's diverse cultural influences. Originating from the Berber tribes of North Africa, this humble dish has evolved through the centuries, embracing the Mediterranean's fresh vegetable bounty and the Maghreb's aromatic spices. The tagine, another culinary masterpiece, tells a tale of a thousand years of Arab conquests and Andalusian refinement. This slow-cooked stew, named after the earthenware pot in which it is cooked, is a symphony of flavors, embodying the heart and soul of Algerian hospitality. And who could forget the Michoui, a feast for the senses, traditionally prepared for special occasions. This celebratory dish, usually a whole lamb or sheep roasted on a spit, is a testament to the communal spirit that is deeply ingrained in Algerian culture. However, Algerian culture is not only defined by its cuisine, it is also home to a host of unique ecosystems, from the snow-capped Atlas Mountains to the coastal plains, each teeming with a diversity of life that is as varied as it is impressive. Among the inhabitants of these diverse landscapes, the Barbary macaque, a primate native to the Atlas Mountains, and the mouflon, a wild sheep that roams the rugged terrain, stand as proud symbols of Algerian biodiversity. These species, along with countless others, contribute to the rich tapestry of life that makes Algeria a biodiversity hotspot. Yet the conservation of this natural heritage is a pressing concern. Efforts to preserve Algeria's biodiversity are not just about protecting individual species, but also about maintaining the intricate web of life that sustains us all. In conclusion, Algeria is a melting pot of Mediterranean and Maghreb influences reflected in its delectable cuisine and rich biodiversity. Its story is one of cultural convergence and natural diversity, a testament to the country's historical resilience and its enduring vibrancy. The flavors of Algeria's cuisine and its unique biodiversity are more than just a feast for the senses. They are a celebration of a heritage that has weathered the sands of time and continues to thrive in the face of adversity. In the heart of Algeria, the capital city Algiers, often known as Algiers the White due to its dazzling white buildings, is a testament to the country's urban progress. The city is a fascinating mix of narrow winding streets and broad boulevards lined with French colonial architecture and modern high-rises. Here, urban development strides confidently forward, marrying the old with the new. But Algiers is not alone in this urban renaissance. Other cities like Oran and Constantine are also embracing modernity while preserving their rich histories, creating a unique blend of the past and the future. Algeria's economy, once heavily reliant on oil and gas, is diversifying. The government now invests in various sectors, including agriculture, industry and services, to foster sustainable development. Renewable energy, particularly solar power, is a major focus, harnessing the abundant sunshine that bathes this North African nation. But what truly sets Algeria apart is its rich culture, a vibrant tapestry woven with threads of Berber, Arab, Ottoman and French influences. Contemporary art thrives here, with galleries showcasing the works of talented local artists. Algerian literature, too, is enjoying a renaissance, with authors penning works that reflect the country's diverse heritage and evolving identity. The Algerian cinema scene is also flourishing, 
with filmmakers producing thought-provoking films that explore the complexities of Algerian society. These films not only entertain but also foster dialogue and understanding, both within Algeria and beyond its borders. For those yearning to explore Algeria, a few practicalities are in order. A visa is generally required and it's advisable to respect local customs and dress modestly. Public transportation is available, but renting a car might offer more flexibility for those eager to explore off the beaten path. No journey to Algeria is complete without visiting its iconic landmarks. The Casbah of Algiers, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, is an absolute must. The Roman ruins of Timgad, often referred to as the Pompeii of Africa, offer a fascinating glimpse into the past. And for the adventurous at heart, the towering dunes of the Sahara await offering a mesmerizing spectacle of shifting sands and starlit skies. In summary, Algeria is a land of contrasts where urban development, economic diversification and cultural initiatives coexist in harmony. It's a place where the echoes of history reverberate in modern cityscapes, where ancient customs mingle with contemporary practices and where the sands of the Sahara hold tales as old as time. So why not delve into the heart of Algeria and discover the secrets it holds? Have you ever wondered how the grains of history and culture converge to create a tapestry of diversity? To unravel this mystery, we delve into the heart of North Africa, into the enchanting lands of Algeria. Our journey begins with the indigenous Berbers, the first known inhabitants of Algeria, whose legacy dates back to over 2,000 years before Christ. Their influence is deeply etched in Algeria's fabric, from the ancient cave paintings in the Tassili Niger National Park to the grandiose ruins of Jamila, a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Fast forward to the 7th century, the arrival of the Arabs brought a new language, religion, and culture to Algeria. The fusion of Berber and Arab cultures gave birth to a unique blend that is still evident in Algeria's language, music, and cuisine. The Ottoman Empire in the 16th century and the French in the 19th further added to the cultural melting pot of Algeria. From Ottoman architecture in the Kasbah of Algiers to the French colonial influence in the city's broader boulevards, each era has left an indelible mark on Algeria's cultural landscape. From the 19th century to the mid-20th century, Algeria underwent a tumultuous period of colonial rule under France. This era, however, was not just a time of struggle, but also of resilience and unity, culminating in Algeria's hard-fought independence in 1962. The courage and determination of the Algerian people during this period are an integral part of the nation's identity today. Today, Algeria is a country that beautifully marries its past with the present. The echoes of history reverberate through the bustling medinas, the whispering sands of the Sahara, and the towering peaks of the Atlas Mountains. The diverse ethnicities, languages, and traditions of its people paint a vibrant picture of a nation that is as rich in culture as it is in history. As we traverse the timeline of Algeria's past, we are reminded of the resilience of its people, the richness of its culture, and the beauty of its landscapes. From the ancient Berbers to the modern Algerians, each chapter of Algeria's history is a testament to the nation's enduring spirit and cultural diversity. So, as we conclude our journey through the sands of time, we leave you with a montage of Algeria's historical richness, cultural diversity, and natural beauty. From the ancient cave paintings of the Sahara to the modern cityscape of Algiers, from the traditional music of the Berbers to the contemporary art scene, Algeria truly is a testament to the power of history and culture in shaping a nation's identity. Thank you for joining us on this journey through Algeria a land where the sands of history intertwine with the vibrant echoes of culture. Until our next adventure, we bid you adieu.